Hey guys, MC Elfin here, and before I start off this video, I would just like to say I'm sorry I didn't upload yesterday because um, I have a sprained fake thumb and it hurt a little bit, a little bit to uh, move out the mice, but whatever. Uh, today I'm going to be doing some War Thunder with you guys. It's a new game. I just started it. I'm only level 3 as you can see up here. Um, and hopefully uh, it will be good quality because it is a hard game to run on the computer. So let's just start a battle. So anything you do, you go to battle and it finds you a battle automatically. And then they give you four planes. You'll see one of them will go up here, one here, one here, one here. And you select whichever plane you want to go. But once you get shot down, you can't use that plane anymore for the battle. So you see I have four planes. I, start, I normally start off with this one, then I go to this one. And then I use these two, because these two have bombs right here. And these ones don't. Wait, oh, this one does. Oh, I didn't know. This one doesn't have. So I'm going to be using this one first, so I don't have the bombs. And then, as you can see on the map, uh, they'll show up later. They'll show where the tanks are. And as you can see here, the mission objective is to destroy the underground vehicle. So you win once you like destroy all of the other vehicles. So I'm just going to start here. So normally with this plane, I try to shoot down the vehicles. See, wait, you see all those dots? Every single one of those is a ground vehicle. One of the game is to destroy all of them. And then all the red guys in the air, those are all enemy planes. So the way you play, you go to go faster and slower. Faster is W, slower is S. A and D are to do like a you know, barrel roll thing. And then to move around, you use your mouse. Now that right there, that little thing that I'm aiming at, trying to aim at with my crosshairs, that's where you wanna, it's where like the game is recommending you aim to hit the guy. And then if you hit him, it'll sort of be like Call of Duty, it'll show you like the X crosshairs. Now I should be hitting him. It's telling me to return to the battlefield, I have no clue why. That 
is not good. So anyway, so now I'll select my next plan. So bombs, how they work is you get two bombs. Well, that's how many I have. I get two bombs. And then on the ground, you'll see there'll be like a little, uh, not, yes, you see like right there, how there's like a little like, crosshair thing, target symbol. That tells you where the bomb is gonna land when you deploy it. And it turns red once a plane or a ground unit is in sight. And to deploy your bombs, to the bombs, you have to press the space bar. So I'm just going to hit this because there's a big grouping here and the bombs should be able to take out a few of them. So, lining up the little target symbol. One of them. I'm going to hit that middle one. Fire. That dropped one of them, I think. Yeah, I still have the other one. You can see it on the bottom of the plane. I have the second bomb. I don't know if you can see it now, but the crosshairs are still there. Drop. Did I get a hit? No, no hit. Anyways. I got a hit before, but no destroyed. So I'm gonna come back down. I'm gonna try to shoot them. Let's just see if I can shoot them. Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. So, I don't know if you noticed, but my two other planes, and this one, um, it's a P2A class, and that is personally my favorite one, because uh, they can carry bombs, they're very small, and they're very um, agile, or they move really quickly, so. I hate it when somebody's on my tail, because then it's like, it's really annoying. Now I have no clue who's trying to... Oh, there's this. I'm just gonna drop down. Oh my gosh. See, now you can see on the bottom left corner again, I have wind damage. So, it tells you what is going on. Okay, my next P2A. See, you can have P2A, 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 and then that one's just a talk. Anyways. So these rounds can go depend uh, last depending on how fast you can take out the enemy troops. The enemy is winning. Oh, um, I'm gonna go and uh, try to blow as many as I can because we are definitely losing here. I don't want to lose. So I'm gonna do it. That guy right there is a little longer actually. I'm gonna try to see him down. There we go. See how it said ground unit destroyed and it blew up. So that means that I successfully got him. So I'm gonna come back and swing around and I'm gonna head for those. Let's see if I can find the guy. There's an artillery over there. I'm gonna go see if I can bomb that. Gotta get some height. Do I have my bombs? Oh, we lost. So you can see in the top section how it shows that we have no more things. Nah, uh, no more lives. Anyways, and that actually, not it. Uh, that tells you uh, how how many more um, ground units you have than the other team. So it's kind of like your health bar, and you lose health when you lose a ground unit. Anyway, so after you get done, after you're done, this time it didn't do it because we lost. But when you do win, it gives you these things, and then you can like research upgrades for your for your vehicle. So let's see if I go to modifications here, I can like research this, or I can you know research this and research this. But anyways, uh, comment down below if you guys liked War Thunder. Um, I find it pretty fun. I hope you guys found it fun. And uh, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content just like this. So, I'll see you guys next week.